morning, everyone, and I hope every mother had a very happy Mother's Day. This event would make a lot of athletes' moms proud. The Upper Peninsula Sports Hall of Fame inducted its 42nd class last night in Delta County. For the first time, the induction banquet took place at the Island Resort and Casino in Harris. More than 250 people attended. This year's class was represented from Ironwood to St. Ignis and Houghton to Menominee. As in past years, inductees' families thanked family, friend, and people who helped them achieve success. But there was a twist or two. Several knew each other from college. And one group came in with its own T-shirt that said, what would Dina do for inductee Dina Sutton Kresge? I'd like to thank my coaches. They're not here, but Rod Coppola and Glenn Cornwall and uh, Mike Geary and Troy Matson. They took a Red Yard Pick girl that was uncoordinated and spent a lot of time and put a lot of patience with me and um, for that I really appreciate them. You know at Northern we would have never gotten it off like we did. You know probably for me it isn't the number of wins or even the championships to be honest with you. It was the just starting that program back in 1976 and watching it grow and prosper and you know so many of the people here tonight were a big big part of that. The 81 state championship team we kind of took it to Three Oaks River Valley in the championship game, who were the state champions two years before that with three starters on that team. Um, so we went the hard way and we did it good, and I'd like to congratulate the Miller's Killers over there that showed up today. You know. Most of this year's class has success in their field of endeavor, but most members excelled as coaches. The UP Sports Hall of Fame now has nearly 425 members. We'll hear from other inductees on Monday's early news. So the result says Matt Kenseth won, Hamlin in second, Jeff Gordon, Jimmy Johnson, Kevin Harvick, and to the standings, as it would be Jimmy Johnson still in that lead, Dale Hernard Jr. in fourth, Jeff Gordon sneaks in that 12th spot, and Brad Kozlowski in the seventh spot, not usually in the top five. But remember, go to our website, UpperMichiganSource.com, for videos, scores, and recaps. I bet Tiger Woods is pretty happy that he uh, came out with the win this time, huh? Fourth win this year, and guess how much this guy made? $1.71 million. No, I, I can't, I can't. Listen to that, it's too depressing. I should go back into golf. You should go back into golf. Yes. <laughs> Thanks, Donnie. Coming up, if you like roller coasters, then there's a brand new one opening up that will make you feel like you're fine.